What if a single war could change the course of a ruler's life and subsequently the history of an entire civilization? Such was the power of the Kalinga War. In the early days of Ashoka's reign, the Kalinga dynasty was a force to be reckoned with. Independent and powerful, it had long evaded the grasp of Ashoka's predecessors, Chandragupta and Bindusar. However, in the eighth year of Ashoka's rule, around 261 BC, the tides of power shifted. Kalinga was invaded, conquered, and brought under the reign of Ashoka, a conquest vividly detailed in the ruler's 13th stone rule. The Kalinga War was a brutal affair. Over 100,000 lives were lost, and a staggering one and a half million people were exiled. An equal number suffered injuries, fell ill, or starved in the war's dreadful aftermath. The impact of the Kalinga War was not confined to the battlefield. It was a pivotal moment for Buddhism and world history. Ashoka, deeply moved by the devastation and loss, underwent a profound transformation. He came to realize that a true victory is not won by the sword, but by conquering the human heart. Thus he laid down his weapons, turning instead to a path of peace. A chance encounter with a Buddhist monk named Upagupta sparked a spiritual awakening in Ashoka. This meeting led to Ashoka's conversion to Buddhism. From then on, he dedicated his life to winning over hearts with truth and non-violence. Now, let's rewind a bit. The Kalinga dynasty, originally covering the area of present-day Puri and Ganjam districts, was prosperous and peaceful. Their prowess in naval technology and their artistic talents contributed to their cultural and economic growth. They controlled the coast for trade in the Bay of Bengal, which was a strategic advantage. However, their prosperity was a thorn in the side of the Mauryan Empire. The Kalinga's strategic location and control over trade routes posed a threat to the Mauryas, hindering communication and trade between Pataliputra and its central Indian possessions. Fast forward to the eighth year of Ashoka's reign, the Kalinga War came to an end. The victory, however, was a hollow one. The devastation caused by the war changed Ashoka's perspective on warfare leading him to vow never to engage in a violent conquest again. The aftermath of the war was catastrophic. Kalinga was looted and destroyed. One million Kalingas perished, and Ashoka's soldiers suffered heavy casualties. The sight of such destruction filled Ashoka with deep regret and sorrow, a sentiment echoed in his edicts. In the years following the Kalinga War, Ashoka embraced Buddhism and dedicated his life to peace and religious education. His reign marked a significant turning point in the history of the Mauryan Empire and the world, leaving a lasting legacy that continues to inspire to this day. The Kalinga War serves as a powerful reminder of the devastation that war can bring and the transformative power of peace. It is a testament to the fact that true victory lies not in conquest, but in the hearts of the people.